Hey guys, it's Beryl here. Happy Saturday. Um, I wanted to talk to you a little bit about accountability. So, um, I'm a member of a fantastic running group called Black Girls Run. And um, I joined the group back in 2012 when I was training for my marathon. And something that I have come to love about the group is accountability. So, last night uh, they posted the locations and times for the Saturday runs. And I, you know, posted on there, I'll see you ladies in the morning. And this morning when I woke up and it was time to go, I had a splitting headache. And um, I messaged, you know, um, one of the run leaders, hey, I'm not going to make it. I have a splitting headache. I'll see you guys next time. Two seconds later, I rebuked the devil, <laughs> evil, whatever you want to call it. And I said, no, no, I've committed to going to these ladies. And no, they probably wouldn't have, you know, called me uh, called me out on it if I didn't show up. Um, they would have said, oh, Burl has a headache, no problem. Um, but I made the commitment to myself, right? And so in terms of accountability, there's three things that you can do to help uh, be more accountable with anything you do in life, really. But particularly, we'll talk about fitness is um, one, you want to try and have an accountability partner, right? Someone that you can check in with on a daily basis. Um, or every couple of days, whatever works with your schedule. Sorry about the sirens. <laughs> and um, two, you also want to have a schedule. So plan your time out. Plan your time to go to the gym, plan your time to prepare food, whatever it is. And number three, be accountable to yourself, most importantly, because at the end of the day, the commitment that you've made is really to yourself, right? You don't do it for anybody else. So one, have an accountability partner. Two, schedule it out. And three, keep the commitment to yourself because you're the one who's most important. Welcome to the Wellness Revolution where my health is my first priority and I'll see you guys next time.